And I'll also mention, too, that a fellow that, that uh, has been in touch with me for an awful long time, his brother was in the CIA, or is in the CIA. He will never talk about the CIA to him. He, I mean, he'll never give anything away whatsoever, except one bit of advice. He said, never watch the television. Never watch the television. It's the greatest scientific indoctrination tool ever devised. Haven't you figured that out? It's changed the whole culture of nations, not just one nation. Why do you think it was mandatory that everybody in Britain give access to televisions by the government? Why do you think China is under the, the same program to get everyone with a TV right now? Because they love to have you entertained. Do you really think that? And India is on the same route as well right now too. Most of your ideas and your opinions and how you emulate because you emulate things, you mimic what you see. As Charles Galton, Darwin and others have said in the past, it becomes you, you become it. And that's what's happened. It's been very, very, very successful. Never watch the television. You can't watch a movie unless you do it critically, if you watch it critically. Not there to enjoy it. Remember what they say, it's your emotions that get you on. And it's interwoven, all these emotional themes all through movies. You're played like a harp. And they embed ideas in you, into you, along with the movies. And predictive programming too. So you'll accept that which is still to come. And you'll, and you'll behave the same way as the characters in the movie when it comes. Oh well, what can you do? I'll just watch much music or television. Yeah. You're given a mind of your own and you've got to use it for yourself. 